I've been coming from jail and sleeping on like the tough jail bed and it's not to even joke about anybody that has been in jail for whatever they've been for. Hi guys, I went through and curl this wig last night and while everything else is fine and like looks how I want it to look I can't really get into this part here I don't really know I guess as time progresses it's gonna fall and like fall more flat which is essentially how I want it but for right now this is how it looks pretty much ready I have a few minutes to spare I'm about to put my boots on and because today I was gonna wear my sneakers but it's gonna rain and it's kind of raining outside lightly but I'm not gonna wear no sneakers in this rain so I'm gonna wear the boots today <sighs> tomorrow I work at my other job <laughs> just now I was thinking about it and I'm like wow I really feel like I don't wanna go I was very sad but whatever I guess I'll go tomorrow but I'm um, yeah. I'm about to leave and head out to work so I'll see you guys maybe later or so. My back is so itchy. Well, let me tell you guys. It's one thing about these boots. Like, they are kind of heavy. And I guess you realize that they're kind of heavy when you've been wearing them for a little minute. Because in comparison to other boots, when I tried this on, I thought it was very light. But, like, wearing it for eight hours, you really feel, you know... You really feel that she's giving a little bit of weight and I refuse to be that person who wears the boots and like brings another pair of shoes. I'm not doing that too much. My little backpack is already full and I'm not gonna be swinging no bags in my hand. I wanna be able to just put my hand in my pocket if it's cold or whatever, not have my hand there with another bag in it. It's just doing too much, but these are a little heavy. However, the snow is melting, so, and it has melted like a great deal. It's a train passing in the background. So, because it's melting, I'm gonna wear my sneakers tomorrow. My, my ankles have gotten some good exercise these last couple of days. Trash bag. I just put the trash down. But look at this shit, y'all. The garbage truck is right out here right now. So it's a good thing that I came and put it out right now. I was going to put it right up here. But I already missed the truck because he already took up the ones that was out here. So I had to bring it on this side. The entire time I kept saying that it sounded like I heard the garbage truck outside <laughs> and just now I blazed down there. It's a good thing that I went when I did. Wow. Because it was right on the block there. I couldn't even leave the trash in front of the gate. Like I had to go on the side because what was in front of the gate, they had already picked up. So that was a dub. However, um, I brought it down and oh, that's good. I just have the fan and the Christmas tree that I need to pretty much figure out and figure out hi guys it's morning time my lips are dry and crusty but i'm headed to work um one more day on the shift before my day off and can't wait i don't feel burnt out or anything however <laughs> i feel like a couple more days under this much pressure and i'm definitely probably gonna feel burnt out so I'm glad that I only have one more day left before I can refresh my body. And I'm telling you, bouncing between these two jobs, I really have to be one with my schedule. So, like this week that I worked eight days and then had a day off on the ninth day, next week I am trying to make sure that, like after my day off, I work three days, and then I have another day off, and then I work four days, and then another day off. So that I never get to the point where I feel very burnt out. And I feel like it's bad scheduling why people who have two jobs always feels like that. Because 
you know you don't set this schedule in a way that it works for you and i might be saying this not realizing that i'm very privileged in a way where i'm able to set my schedule to work for me and others might not have that option but I'm very grateful anyways i'm almost at the bus stop so i'm about to go and i'll see you guys later hi guys just got home i'm so very tired to the point where i was kind of falling asleep on the bus which is very ghetto so i know that i'm tired so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna sleep until six o'clock which means that i'm gonna get to sleep for two hours and then i'm gonna wake up and put this on the back of a brand new phone case that i just bought that is inside of this packaging let me see if since i'm standing here right now if i can open it to like show you guys real quick real quick so this is what it looks like i don't know if this is going to protect my phone any at all because it doesn't really it's not going to really go over it that much but it's cute anyways and then it comes with this short strap and this longer strap i can't remember how much i paid for this pretty sure it wasn't worth it <laughs> or it's just cute but... oh the way how i'm tired i feel like even my wig is falling off try and put it on and see i have to have my mental card in there i feel like this one is just cute it's not really functional because it doesn't really protect the phone too much but you know okay yeah definitely does not protect the phone but it's cute so i really like that i think it's very pretty i'm still gonna put this here in the back because why not i've i'd never wear it without having something on the back just now too when i was coming i was thinking i was searching amazon to get one of those things that the nurses wear over their heads because honestly some days i'll just be filming like throwing something on my head and just going with my wig braids in there and everything same way um today's definitely one of those days let me take a nice little boomerang on instagram because you know if it's not on instagram it didn't happen so i have to try and make sure that this phone case this phone does not drop which is like damn near impossible because this case is not really going to protect the phone much i feel like i'm rumbling right now <laughs> three minutes to four o'clock and i really need to go sleep so i just wanted to pop in and say hi no as a matter of fact i think this is where i'm going to end the vlog because this is an addition this is like a week in my life you guys i'm so tired like tomorrow's the last day of this shift and then i am tomorrow evening when i come home i'm gonna sleep like i'm gonna sleep like i've been coming from jail and sleeping on like the tough jail bed and it's not to even joke about anybody that has been in jail for whatever they've been for anyways gonna go hi guys happiest holiday happy holiday season happy last day of this rotation for me just a happy day in general i'm ready to go to work but today is a very rainy and very very windy day so i'm gonna be taking an uber this morning because what is the point of working so hard if one of the days you can take an uber so we're taking an uber today so that's why i'm here kind of just procrastinating also last night when i was going to bed i put some caramex on my lips and this morning when i woke up i felt so refreshed and so renewed like i'm gonna have to start doing that more often anyways like i said earlier today is the last day of this rotation this darn eight days straight so what is that oh so tomorrow is my day off and i'm very very excited like my soul is so happy and i was telling one of my friends that the way how i'm gonna sleep tomorrow is literally nobody's business like i'm gonna sleep so good tomorrow and she really just feels like i sleep entirely too much which i don't but to each his own but um yeah i wanted to come in and officially close out this week in my life video because i've been filming this all week thank you guys for watching i hope you guys are having the happiest holiday season considering and i'll see you guys in the next vlog